This is KNEB.TV weather from the KNEB Storm Center, your trusted source for weather. We're going to be dealing with uh, mostly cloudy skies to start off the evening. Cloudy as we go through the overnight hours and into tomorrow morning as well. We continue to be mainly cloudy out there. Uh, the weekend was colder that we had. We had some light snow. A little warmer by the end of this week, but uh, don't expect things to get too warm out there at all. 22 right now in Casper. It's 19 in Laramie, 25 in Denver. You see 20s out here for most of the Cornhusker State. 21 in Alliance, 25 in Ogallala, 22 right now in Mullen. Winds thankfully at about 10 to 15 miles an hour. Strongest here in the sand hills. That's dropping wind chills down into the low teens in many areas. Still a 20 degree wind chill here in Scotts Bluff, 8 right now up in Lusk. Very cold conditions there. Getting on the bus tomorrow, we're going to have cloudy skies to start your bus ride. And then by the way home, those clouds will dissipate a little bit. We'll be sunny on the way home. Temperatures in the low 30s. Still pretty chilly out there. Tonight, you're going to see a few light snow showers heavier off to our south and east. They're going to be dealing with accumulating snow in those areas. We have a little light snow try to form here across the region tonight into early tomorrow morning. Lows are going to be all over the map. See these teens here? But look at Shadron at 39, Gordon at 41 for a low tonight. Warmer there off to the north. A few light snow showers early tomorrow quickly dissipate. That bigger band of snow moves to the southeast, pulls all the clouds with it. We'll be sunny by late in the day tomorrow after a cloudy start to the day, and we'll be turning mainly sunny by afternoon. Next little wave tries to come in later on tomorrow night into early Wednesday morning. Temps tomorrow going to be in the 30s primarily, again warmer up in the far northern reaches of the Panhandle. No real major precip, everything's going to be pretty light. Snowfall light as well, should be under an inch for anybody that uh, gets some snow. But just off to our south and east, there's a band of two to five inches of snow or possibly a little more than that setting up shop in central Nebraska. A few snow showers possible into the early morning hours tomorrow, 16. Cloudy skies to start the day, can't rule out a flurry early. Temps in the mid 30s and then we got some breezy to windy conditions coming in our extended forecast. Another system arrives late Thursday into Friday and drops us back down into the 40s and windy conditions develop by Friday. And then through the weekend, we'll stay breezy to windy at times. Temps rebound though, upper 50s and upper 40s and low 50s. And Monday, by the way, the official first day of winter there is we are going to be at 52 degrees with breezy conditions. So a pretty active forecast, uh, all things considered, over the next seven days.